wrapped up here at Fallen to Motorsport. We've worked on this truck many times. We've also restored the 65 Mustang for the, the, for this customer. Uh, she has a few classics that we always work on, also as well as her new cars. So yeah, so what we did to this Bronco exactly, there's a mice that chewed up some wires, messed up the distributor, and needed a battery. So we did that. We also replaced the valve cover gasket, it was leaking. And yeah, we wrapped it up, detailed it. It's a beautiful car. We've done the interior also in the past. Everybody's filming this truck. It's definitely a rare piece. We're now just wrapping it up and uh, about to tow it back to the customer. Thank you. Alright guys, here we have this uh, BMW F80 M3 that came in for a uh, <coughs> new radiator and, he and heat exchanger. We went ahead and got a CSF heat exchanger and an OEM radiator. The reason why it came in is because this stone flew from the highway, went through his grill and damaged both exchanger and radiator. Two birds, one stone, right here. So we got that taken care of and uh, gonna get it back on the road, thank you. Alright guys, Joseph from to Motorsport. Here we have a BMW F90 M5 that we just did our stage two tune on this car. So this car just gained 140 horsepower, 140 torque only with our tune. So yeah, that's completed. It is a competition BMW M5. It has a full and performance exhaust. 
sounds amazing. Customer want to adjust the tune. We got that all done here at 402 Motorsport. Crazy horsepower gains, torque gains. This vehicle come with a four-wheel drive option and a two-wheel drive option. So if you're at a light, you're trying to race from the dig, BMW giving you the opportunity to be able to be in four-wheel drive mode. And if you were trying to go through the canyons, you're trying to drift, slide around, you can also go in two-wheel drive mode. It's a, probably one of my favorite options in this car. It still handles great in both. Um, enjoy. So we just hopped out the M5, jumped in this 2020 C63S Mercedes AMG. Another sand black, we've been doing a lot of same color ones, uh, so it's not the same one. But yeah, so we've been getting almost two, three a week, all sand black. Uh, honestly, it's probably my favorite option. I like the steering wheel more on this one than the M5. I believe the M5 also has a faster launch. I'm not sure yet who's faster, but we can go ahead and try it probably in low bed and see which car is actually faster. What we did to this car, we did a stage two tune and our exhaust system. So it has a complete stage two, tune and exhaust. The car sounds amazing. Also has an option, you can close the flap, back to quiet mode, even, it don't matter which, um, if you're in efficient race mode, sport mode, um, you can always close the flap. So you can also be in efficient with the flap open. You can be in race with the flap open or closed. It's pretty sick. Uh, what Mercedes did with this car with the launch mode being a rear-wheel drive car and puts the torque down and it's not breaking loose their traction system even though we have full traction ESP off and it's still hooking from the dig not launching as an all-wheel drive mode but for a rear-wheel drive car with that much torque and you're getting that good of a launch it's awesome hope you guys enjoyed and uh, thank you for watching and subscribing we'll see you again Thank <laughs> you.